Hey, what's going on, everybody? It's Sunday, March 31st. We are here at the end of the quarter. I'm going to talk once again about DGEM Chain. I did my first video yesterday, uh, which is called WTF, um, is a uh, L3, which is DGEN Chain, right? Uh, DGEN Chain is the first L3 chain on Ethereum, meaning it actually is residing on the base layer. And from the base chain, uh, effectively, you can get to DGEN chain, but technically you can get from any L2, like Polygon or Arbitrum, Optimism, et cetera, into DGEN chain. But in this first video, you'll see exactly how um, you can get onto the DGEN chain, what bridge to use, how to use that. If you want to know the basics of how to do that, watch this first video. Okay, on my channel, Alpha Trades. Today, what I'm going to be talking about is exactly what do you do on the DGEN chain, right? Because everybody thinks that there's really nothing to do. Um, and I do agree, it's, it's a relatively new chain, but it's not that new. And there are a few things to do aside from punting, you know, meme coins that are there. So I'm going to talk about that today. All right, so let's get started. First things first, um, once again, make sure you sign up with my Warpcaster link, which I have in the YouTube video. If you do sign up with Warpcaster um, with my link, um, I can gift you some free DGEN, um, but I do think that they've raised the limit. You have to have X amount of DGEN uh, tokens in your wallet for me to be able to give you some free DGEN. But either way, if you just message me, I can give you um, some free DGEN tokens, okay? So first, uh, let's get started, right? Um, DGEN was first released as a token on the base network, all right? So let's get that straight. It started off um, at a very, very you know modest market cap. I would say somewhere around, um, wow, like basically two, one million or $2 million. And then quickly it took off all the way to 60 to 70 million, came back down to 10. And then now it's obviously off to the races and it's currently at $700 million. So that's a 700X in pretty much, you know, three months, right? Since the beginning of the quarter till the end of the quarter, which we're on right now. Um, I'm not going to talk about price much about DGEN because it doesn't really matter. Yeah, you know, I feel like most of the move is, you know, already done in terms of the bulk of the gains. Obviously, you know, the DGEN chain can easily go up um, from here, and it probably will, right? Because again, um, I think the TVL on DGEN chain, if I'm not mistaken, is probably close to 20 million. Um, correct me if I'm wrong, but if you go to Decent and these guys, so this um, project Decent, I think is the one that built the bridge um, to convert your DGEN tokens moved over from base chain um, onto the DGEN chain. So I think this is the group that did that, the community. So um, for the most part, you know, I, I think one thing that I find fascinating is that um, once they started building, the products on DGEN chain really started to take off really fast, right? Because if you think about any L, um, L2, L3, or even L1 chain, right? What exactly are altcoins or especially chains or ecosystems? They're, they're basically, you know, large platform products where you can build stuff on top. And what do we typically do in crypto? We swap stuff, right? We swap stuff with a native currency. So for us, it's the DGEN um, token, right? Because it's the DGEN chain. And again, you can go to my... Um, first video that I mentioned to figure out how do you go and add the network DGEN chain, okay? So once you're on the network of DGEN chain, you take your DGEN tokens and you buy any odd number of random altcoins that are there, right? It could be meme coins. It could be um, something like a DGEN swap. This is a uh, swap token that is associated with this swap DEX. Um, you can buy, um, I don't know, like all kinds of random stuff. You can buy DJT, which is the uh, Donald J. Trump, uh, or rather DJ J. Trump 
meme coin. You can look at the list here. If you go to deck screener, you can go to DGen chain here on the left, and you can see all the stuff that's trending right now. Everything that's been created, you know, newly populated, how much liquidity it has, um, how much FTV does it have, how much volume is taking place. But I will warn you that a lot of these coins are literal scams, right? So let me give you a 24 hour rundown, okay? So if you turn these upside down, a lot of these basically have gone to zero, right? And in fact, a lot of them that have gone to zero have been removed from this list. So a majority of the coins, unfortunately, um, have no way of being vetted by Dex Screener that they're complete scams or honey pots or pump and dumps. That is up to you to do your own research, right? I would be extremely careful of how you want to punt meme coins, um, whether it's on DGen chain or not. Okay. So first things first, DGen swap, right? You take your DGen. Um, once you bridge your DGen over from base chain, wherever, whatever chain you came from, bridge it over a DGen chain, and then you can start swapping into this other token, right? So let's just do a quick swap just so y'all can see. So let's, let me just buy some DNU, right? So 52 DGen gets me um, 724 uh, DNU tokens, right? So I'll just do a quick swap. As you can see, it's um, relatively fast, right? As soon as you pretty much Click that, boom, done, okay? Um, they don't have their auto refresh yet, so I have to refresh manually, but there you can go, right? There you can see right there, there's my uh, DNU tokens, okay? So that's step number one, DGen swap. Step number two is you gotta use this explorer. So let's just say, you know, any random address that you type in here, um, let's go to explorer.dgen.tips. So any address, right, if you have your, um, ETH, um, EVM address, right? You could just click on that and start doing research into what exactly is happening with your token. If you feel like your um, swap failed, why did it fail? You, you know, here I'm just clicking random transactions, right? It'll show you kind of like um, your ETH uh, Explorer or your base scan or your soul scan, if you're familiar with that. This is just the DGen Explorer. So you can start doing research on you know, tokens and charts and assets and you know, doing um, blockchain um, analysis or chain analysis on individual addresses, tokens, blocks, et cetera, okay? So that's Explorer, right? Then we have fun stuff like mint.fun. This is a website where you can find you know, stuff to mint, right? These are NFTs. I think they probably have tokens coming up. You can find free stuff on here too, where you can mint pretty fast, pretty easily uh, for free. So you have this as a, um, you know, basically another NFT minting style website. Again, very similar to what's on Base Chain or Solana or Ethereum, right? Because I'm just showing you guys what are the parallel products that exist on other chains that now exist on um, the DGen chain. So DGen Swap. Mint.fun, the Explorer that I just showed you, right? So we have all those things so far. Next, we have nftdgen.lol, right? This one's actually pretty cool because um, this is probably the more popular um, popular NFT launch pad or popular, um, uh, what's it called? A domain um, service that you could buy, like the .dgen domain service that you could mint. Um, I think there's a lot of cool stuff on here. They'll show you also like activity points. So how do you earn more activity points? Again, my goal right now is to be very active on Warpcast. It's to collect as many DGen tokens because DGen is going to be the main token of this entire economic backbone of DGen swap, of NFT DGen, of mint.club, everything, every other product that I'm going to show you, this currency is the backbone of that entire economy, right? It is the central currency of all products on the DGen chain. In the same way that, you know, if you go to Ethereum, if ETH is the main currency typically on every single one of these products, whether it's Uniswap, EtherFi, you know, Pendle, OpenSea, whatever you want to call it, right? Same thing with Solana. Sol 
is the main currency that you use on Marinaid or Gito, Camino, um, you know, uh, Magic Eden, which is the NFT platform, Solent, all this stuff that we use on a day-to-day -day basis. So you got to ask yourself, okay, if DGEN chain right now or the DGEN token is the main currency in all these products, how do I make more of it? How do I earn more of that? Right, because that's going to be the core currency. Mm -hmm. More often than not, the main economic currency almost always goes up the most beyond majority of its underlying products. Right. So, for example, you know, Solana started at I don't know, like pennies or a few dollars a few years ago. You know, and I think in 2019 or 2020, it started literally. You know. Um, less than a dollar. Actually, in fact, it was pennies. And Solana now trades at almost $200, right? So that's a massive like, you know, 2000 X, depending on where it started off trading at pennies. Same thing with Ethereum. Ethereum started, you know, less than like a dollar. I remember in 2016. Okay. Now it trades at $3,700. I think same thing will happen with DGEN. And by the way, Ethereum um, trades at a uh, what's it called? Let me let me see here real quick. Okay, let's go to Coin Gecko. ETH trades at uh, three thousand six hundred dollars with a four hundred and thirty billion market cap. Solana trades at two hundred two dollars with ninety billion market cap. Let me show you guys where Dgen Chain is. It's not even on the top one hundred. Is it here? Let's see. Dgen Chain trades number uh, 152 on market cap, right? $692 million. That's very far away from the top 10, which is, you know, 20 billion and up for the major L1 or, or you know, layer ecosystems. So why am I mentioning that? Again, to hit the point home that you want to get your hands on as much DGEN tokens as possible for the future if you think this is the chain that's going to survive. And by the way, none of this is investment advice, okay? <laughs> Don't buy DGEN tokens because you feel like some guy on the internet is telling you to. I'm just telling you this is the backbone currency of this economy. And if you believe that DGEN token or DGEN chain is going to survive in the future, then this might be a token you want to consider, okay? Again, not investment advice. All right. So um, how do you earn those DGEN tokens? That's what we're talking about right now. So Warpcast is one of those ways where you can be active. It's kind of like your Twitter. Um, like I said, my Warpcast link is in the uh, YouTube description below. I can gift you some DGEN tokens if you're new. Um, you, can, you can go to uh, different channels, right? You can go to different channels and uh, start contributing. You can see base channel has its own... Um, you know, people who are having conversations about the base chain, about, you know, metrics, um, you know, here's all the metrics that are going on about um, uh, base chain, how many users it's gaining, how many transactions per day, et cetera, et cetera, right? You can go here and then see what other channels are out there. Depe, by the way, is another sort of meme coin, bonding curve coin on the DGEN chain, which I'm going to talk about in a second. This is another channel. Again, if you want to contribute into individual channels, you can kind of be at home here and you can just type cast and say, you know, test, right? Like that. And then here you get to select the channel. Like what channel do you want to post this in? Meaning this is not like Twitter where when you post this somewhere, it goes everywhere all over Twitter. You can post this to be channel specific. Like if I want to discuss, you know, base chain is cool, I probably want to post it in the base channel. If I want to talk about, you know, Depe is a solid meme going to $1 billion plus, then I would post this in the Depe channel, right? Like that. Okay. I'm not going to say those things, but that's how you um, can post in individual channels. And then what happens is, so let's just say you go here, right? Um, you can create posts like this and then people could just 
gift you, you know, free um, DGEN tokens, right? So here I can just kind of see, I don't know, so, so, some, some people typically will just randomly just gift you um, free like DGEN tokens, uh, depending on, you know, how popular they are or if they have tokens to gift. But the point is that's how you earn your DGEN tokens, right? So what we're going to test out now is the NFT DGEN, which is another product on the DGEN chain. So here, you know, let's just say I want to pick up a DGEN, dot DGEN name, right? I don't know. Um, I'll pick up 0x AML, which I think I may have already bought, but let me try it out. No, I already bought it. So what if I bought 0x AML 2? right? Just for the heck of it. Okay. So I then click confirm. It cost me 69 DGEN, right? And just like that, boom, done. See, now I am 0x on level two. What else do I want to be? Um, so by the way, this dot DGEN is so new right now. Remember the ENS names that were coming about, the dot soul names, right? So remember ENS um, domains, best sellers. Okay. Just, just, you know, for example, like back in the day, paradigm, all these best sellers, they sold for hundreds and thousands of dollars, right here, here on dot DGen, you are very, very early to buy some cool stuff. So let's buy some cool stuff, right? What about builders or builder? Can I buy builder? Nope. Oh yes, I can builder, right? Jesse Pollock, all he talks about is building on base and builders this, builders that. Sweet. I'm going to buy builders, right? Um, what about uh, what's a popular meme that's going on right now? You know, obviously Depe is a popular meme. So let's try Depe. Nope. It's already bought. Degen Pepe, maybe. Let's try that. Nope, it's already taken. So someone was clearly smart and they bought that before me or else I definitely would have. Um, what about, uh, what's this? Oh, lens post. So this is a product, by the way, I wanna show you guys in a second, but let's try lens post, right? Lens post dot degen. Can I buy that? Yeah, I can buy that. See, I'll gift this to my friend. Um, LensPost is a really cool product, folks. I know the founder. Um, her name is Shakti. She's from India. Um, she built this incredible product, and I'm going to gift her that um, LensPost.dgen um, username that I just bought, right? So we bought LensPost. What else? Can I buy Crypto.dgen? Nope. Crypto. Can I buy DGen.dgen? Nope. Okay, so a lot of these are taken, right? But the point is that as you get smaller, like the number zero, it's gonna cost you a lot more. Zero X, you know, it's probably not even available, right? But the point is that you can buy those usernames, those domain names, uh, .dgen here, okay? And then you'll see your activity points start updating, right? Because you just bought a bunch of stuff. Okay, so, so we bought that, right? Then uh, we still have some tokens left over. So we have 293. So let's just buy something fun, right? Okay, how about this? This looks really cool, right? So this is a so happy to degen. Um, shoot, insufficient payment. I don't know why that's saying that. Definitely have the degen tokens. Let's try something else, right? Let's buy something, something fun. Oh, well, this looks fun at all. Uh, that looks cool. I like the Pepe ones. Okay, there we go. Let's buy this thing. All right, boom, done. We now own that. Um, we now own this NFT. So we have our profile. Let's see what we can see here. Okay. It's not really showing for some reason. Well, in any case, you know, we bought a bunch of stuff, right? Obviously. Um, once we're able to kind of see 
Uh, once we're able to kind of see that, uh, you know, here's all the stuff that we own, then maybe somewhere down the line, you can, you know, mint more NFTs, you can sell them. Um, you know, you could basically create a whole marketplace uh, and a capability of uh, exchanging all these products. Okay, cool. Let's move on. Well, it's another product that we can use. Well, I've talked about this before, right? Mint.club is a place where um, you can claim airdrops. Like, for example, here, you can literally, again, go on the DGEN chain, select your wallet, right? And then just start claiming like free Depe tokens. You know, here, I'm just going to claim eight of these tokens. It's free, right? It's free for everybody to claim. Right, so that's a cool thing about this um, this new chain is like everybody is so new that there's free money going out everywhere. So why not claim it, right? I'm going to claim some more. Okay, these are Depe tokens. This is not DGEN token, by the way. This is the Depe token, okay? So here I'm going to claim some more Depe tokens, right? But the cool thing is, you know, after you claim a bunch of the Depe tokens, what you could do is... So now that we've claimed some of those, you can buy some more. So let's just say I want to buy 50 more, 50 DGEN tokens worth of the Depe token. All right. Whoops. So buy 50. So that gets me 29,815. Okay. Here, click buy and boom. Right. Done. Okay. So we're minting those tokens. Um, I'm not going to talk about this bonding curve stuff because uh, I think it's a little bit more complex to discuss. But basically, uh, Depe is an extremely, extremely popular meme in the DGEN chain. I don't know why I'm not going to question it, but it is, right? It is probably the most popular meme right now. Um, you can kind of see uh, Depe right now trades at 22 million um, market cap. Um it has this like weird looking chart, but I think it's because of how the bonding curve works. But everything else like Dinu, which is, you know, meme coin on DGen chain or DGen swap itself, which is, a you know, swap decks on DGen chain. Um, all these things kind of trade relatively at a lower market cap compared to um, what I just showed you, which is Depe, right? Trading at 22 million. So point is, I think there's a lot of demand for this particular meme coin. Now, again, non-investment advice. I have no idea if it's going to do well in the future at all, but it's just, you know, something that's there, right? So now we have the Depe tokens, right? If you want to sell the Depe tokens, you can. And so let's just sell 6,600, right? Um, then I will get back 11 DGEN tokens. See, right now I have 268. So let's see. I sell those. Okay, 268 plus 11. I should be able to get. Sell it already. I don't know if I sold it already. No, maybe I didn't. Let me check one more time. Oh, there it is. Okay. Now it updated. Okay. So I had 218, then I just got 11 more. So 229. Okay. So point is, um, I am able to transact on Mint.club relatively seamlessly, right? So every product that I've showed you so far is pretty easy to use and it's fast and it's very cheap and it's on the DGEN chain, okay? So today's video, again, to reiterate, is all about understanding the DGEN chain, which once again is a L3 product, right? L3, which is one of the newest chain products that is out on the Ethereum or base um, chain network. And it's something new. And new means you're early, you're going to get scratched up, you might make mistakes, you might buy stupid stuff or make stupid mistakes, you might lose some money. But again, if you're careful, and you're managing your risk, um, not, you know, blowing your entire stack on random 
degen chain coins or meme coins, you should be fine if you know you believe that degen chain is going to do well in the future. Okay, but please do your own research, right? So we talked about mint.club. I already talked about you know airdrops in yesterday's video, the the previous video that I showed you. Um, you can see all the other stuff that you can claim, just like free airdrops, right? Here, I can just click on claim free Depe, right here again, you know, boom, right? Free tokens, okay? Why would you not want free stuff, you know? So it's it's very fast, very easy to claim. And then they have other stuff. Like, I don't know what this is, um, the uni tokens, but I'm going to claim it, right? Why not? The transactions are cheap. You never know if the uni token or whatever this token is does well into the future. Maybe it gives you an airdrop of another token. Maybe you get a free NFT. But the point is that this being a new chain, you're going to get a lot of opportunities of free airdrops, you know, free and cool stuff. Okay. Next up is Telegram bots, right? I think Prodigy bot is the topic of conversation right now on the DGen chain. So for example, like, if you wanted to buy, you know, Dinu really quick, you grab the contract address, you use the Prodigy bot and Telegram and just quickly snipe, you know, new meme coins. Okay. I don't know much about it. I have not used Prodigy bot, but I use a lot of Telegram bots, right? And they work pretty well. So again, non-investment advice, do your own research on this stuff. Okay. So other than that, Explorer, I already told y'all, and then Lens Post. Uh, Lens Post is actually, um, I don't think it's available on um, on the DGen chain, but here's kind of how it works, right? So basically, you have the ability to connect your wallet, um, and then you have, you know, like templates and stuff. Let me see here what we can do. Okay, so let me see. So let's just do this. Right. Okay. So we're going to connect this wallet. Oh, oh, okay. No, well, it's on Polygon. No, I don't want to do that. I thought it is on base chain. Let me try real quick just to be safe. Let's retry. <laughs> yes, I think it is on base chain. Yeah. Okay. So there we go, right? So here's the cool thing. Okay, so you have um, this product that is, you know, called Lens Post, and you have all these memes. Okay, you, what you could do is you can recreate these memes, and you have this like AI imaging thing, like add a duck. Okay, um, and what will happen is, you know, maybe you do something like that. I don't know. You guys know how it works, right? Like. AI imaging and whatnot, add a duck here. And then what you could do is you could just take this thing and share, and you can share it right on Farcaster. Okay. So that's actually the cool part is, you know, you can click what channel you want to post it on. You can log in uh, to your Farcaster account. Um, and that's the great thing about something like Lens Post, which is that you will often see. So here's the creator of. Uh, lens post. Okay. So you'll often see her create these memes created by lens post and you could post in Farcaster and it looks really cool like this, like this was po um, created by lens post, which is this app right here, which is, you know, again, a um, AI generated image and you just post it on here. Sometimes what you could do is you can create NFTs out of it. And you have the ability to tell Farcaster like, oh, put a mint button in here and have people mint this AI generated image, which is another cool thing, right? Uh, and you could tell people once you click mint, right? You, you have to be able to um, pay with DGEN tokens or pay with ETH tokens, right? So I think that, that is a really fascinating thing about this lens post app and make sure you guys check it out. Because again, if your goal is to get your hands on the DGEN tokens, 
right? One of the ways to do that is create a lot of memes, create a lot of content, use lens post to create that content and post it on Warpcast or Farcaster. And then have people, you know, mint your NFTs or like your content and, and donate you um, DGEN tokens. <laughs> okay. So this is pretty much the entire ecosystem that I know of so far in DGEN chain that, that I actually use often, right? Obviously, there's a ton of new products that are coming out. Uh, I'm not fully aware of every single product, but I am aware of, you know, the ones that I want to use more the ones, you know, I think are going to do well. And then tokens that I think I want to invest in. Again, not investment advice, right? So tokens like Depe, tokens like DGEN, and then all this other stuff that's kind of on my list. Um, that's what I want to be paying attention to right now on the DGEN chain. I still spend a lot of time on base chain. I still spend a lot of time on Solana. But this is where the momentum is. I think it's a really cool product and um, I want to keep testing it out. All right. Anyway, hope you guys enjoy the content. Make sure you follow me here on Farcaster. Uh, if you do sign up with my link below um, for Farcaster, just shoot me a message or tag me or something. And uh, I'll see if I can get you some DGEN tokens if you do sign up through my link. All right. Good luck, everybody. Take care. Um, have fun on the DGen chain. I will catch up with y'all soon. Cheers.